Upon waking up, you will find a letter on your side of the bed. Or on the other side of the bed. <sighs> Addressed to you, and it's in Liliana's handwriting. It says the following. This will come as sudden, but I pray you will understand. Yesterday, I was approached by someone while out at market. Someone who claimed to be searching for Captain Liliana. Said they were paid good coin to locate me for someone else. Supposedly a contact from Ireland. Someone who desperately needs to find me, but cannot cross the border themselves. Part of me wanted to tell them they had the wrong woman. Send them off on a thus impossible quest to find the quote-unquote right person. Part of me, however, has always struggled with the knowledge that I abandoned my oath when I left Adwick. We both know they'd either be looking forever or return. You've enough on your shoulders, without adding to the number of potential shadows to look out for. So I've taken some of my belongings and left to meet with this contact. I don't know how long I'll be gone. Truthfully, I don't know what to expect. I hope you can forgive me, if not now, then someday. If I'm fortunate, this will be a short venture, but my gut tells me I won't be fortunate. My heart breaks to be apart from you, but you and I both know, duty comes before all else. Take care of yourself. I love you. Never forget that. Liliana I'm sure.
got you up so early? He produces a small letter. Addressed to him. Stubborn. She insisted that you've been looking over your shoulder enough. Hey. I can't escape it. It just keeps happening. What do you mean? I keep leaving. It's unfair to yourself to say and believe, Kyla. This is different. She made a choice. Her honor took her somewhere that she needed to be. She did not want really? to leave. I do not think she was ever able to forget. We can hear you, Raven. That she had left her comrades behind. That she knew what was happening in Ireland. And she followed her heart. But the guilt ate away at her. I was just <clears throat> being selfish, I suppose. I just. It's, it's not selfish to feel the way that you feel. You're allowed to feel the way that you feel. You're allowed to feel that weight. This is not your fault. It's nothing that you've done. If my mission <clears throat> took me somewhere that Raylan would not follow, I have my honor I must uphold. I have my promises I must uphold. Because when a man or woman is stripped of everything, all they have left is their word. The value and weight of your character. Something that most think is so unimportant but it's people like that that are viewed that way that carry the weight of the world with their words the rooms go quiet when they speak their advice is heeded they make the most change I would never want to walk away from Raylan, never. It would shatter my heart to bits. I will not even pretend it wouldn't. But if she said to me that she wasn't ready to follow to this horrible place I planned to go, I would tell her that I love her, that I must do what I must. And if it all goes well, I will come back. 
And that is what you have been told, my son. Yeah. You are a good man who's done nothing wrong. I saw the way that you treated them, the way you tried to protect them. Comforted them. Because you know all too well. They have not departed because of you. Nor did she. I am sorry, my son. I am. I wish I knew what words I may utter to take the pain away. But even I struggle with such things. You struggle with words. It's a symbol. <laughs> yes, I do. You're never around for it. But I have said many times to your mother That for all of my extensive vocabulary, I can never find the words I need to express her importance. And when I talk to you, I can never find the words that I need to express my pride. I try. And perhaps to you it sounds adequate. <laughs> to me, it feels as if I do not say enough. <clears throat> Well, my words do not carry enough because there is so much more behind it. Well, that is a different conversation. All I can say is, I am here if you need me. Take today off from the forge. Go forget about things for a while. <clears throat> I have orders I could be working on. I've got them. Do something else. Keep your hands busy. Go see some friends. Get some drinks. Do you need money? I have enough. I'll, I'll be okay. Thank you, though. And thank you for... helping me to understand, I guess. Course. It's a father's duty. I am. Made you breakfast if you're hungry. I can save it if you're not. Maybe later. I don't have much of an appetite right All now. Alright. Sorry. You're fine. That's a compliment. More an hour. <laughs> Self-destructive ways, I guess. When we suffer, we punish ourselves. <laughs> Make sure you at least eat dinner. Wait here for me before you leave the house. I'm just going to grab something. Yeah.
Oh, I gotta clear my eyes, chat. <laughs> <clears throat> Get those waterworks, lads. Ugh. <clears throat> ask you how you are but I will ask do you want to talk about it or do you want to pretend like it didn't happen and join me for some work today you'll be well paid I don't know I'm just tired of losing you put your dedication and heart into someone and they betray you or die or leave or just tired I'm sorry There's nothing I can really say to make you feel better, but I don't think that's what you need right now. Knowing your feelings is important, and hopefully they had a good reason for what they did. Unfortunately, it was probably the best. She was protecting her honor. I don't. I never wanted to keep her here in the gilded cage. I never wanted that for her. And. I guess the weight of everything finally caught her up with her. <sighs> uh, 
I want to be selfish. I thought that maybe... This time I could just hang on to someone. I knew she felt bad for leaving. It was selfish to think she'd stay for me. You are not selfish. I don't think you're capable of that. Maybe once upon a time before I knew you, but not since then. Just know that you're not alone. I have no words of advice, and I'm sure you're not looking for them. I am not sure how to comfort you either, but, but I don't know if you're looking for that. What I can promise you is... Your father's granted you permission to disappear for the day, or even just the morning. You can make a couple silver. Or you can go tink away at the anvil. Not allowed to work the forge today, apparently. What's the job? Well, I need to leave soon. Uh, it's just in Cassetto. It's just in Cassetto. Don't make me. I need to speak with someone. It's quite urgent. I was gonna come grab you anyway, but... I wanted to see how you felt first. Totally understand if you want to go disappear and... Do you want me or <clears throat> someone else? I think you would benefit from coming with me. If you can find me a... Will I need a sword? What's... No. It's just business. No bloodshed. No drama. Just making connections here. I want to grow roots. At least a little bit. What do you want to do? Nothing good. Lead the way. Let's make quick then. Hopefully we can find Torchy with Vesrin. I feel like I should put my armor on for this. Ah, <clears throat> uh, yes. Yeah. Just in case. Whatever makes you feel more comfortable. I'll be right back. You got. I just say. You recall what we heard in the north? 
when you are at the top of the mountain. But yes, what does that have to do with anything? Apparently they heard a female there. Trying to replace it with something different. Are you stunned all around? Mm hmm. Yeah. That's oh, why I'm taking on the we're all trying to move past something. Huh? Sure, I, like I got a question that. for you. That's very nice. That would be an understatement, my friend. Uh, later tonight, do you, you think I could borrow one of your bellows? I'm attempting something and I need to control enough, some my flame in my brewery. It's hard to get unstuck. I'm uh, not working the forge today. Dizim's inside. He'll be out in a second, though. You can ask him. Mm. I guess you could say one of the few. Okay. At least I think everything all right. Yeah. Best of luck then. Getting unstuck. See you later, Clifford. See ya. You haven't seen uh, Tang around, have you? He's on a type of mission. No. Looks good. But you won't miss him, I'm sure. Yeah. Have you seen your um, My counterpart? Yes. No, I haven't. Whatever He's that word means. Missing, actually. I have no idea where he is. I normally see him in the morning. That's a pity. What about um? For me to be up on my feet chasing Cordy. someone is not the interest or highlight I haven't of my seen her day. Either. Not interested. Neat. <laughs> right. Well, I guess it's just you and I then, Sharik. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's totally not around. Who's oh. yeah. you, you get, you get somebody like run into you or something? Oh. She's most likely with him though. So. Oh, my body uh, takes up half the roadway. <laughs> Unless he's crazy Hi. and like murdered her in a bush, and I'm gonna guarantee they're together. <clears throat> I wasn't listening when he said where they were. Uh, I have no idea. We could check his house. All I know is that... Maybe. I, I am on a time frame now, I know that. Right. Once daytime rolls around, I need to be here for the uh, Mercenaries Guild. On the way there, I might as well be honest with you. Don't want you finding out later on and being upset. Have you heard of Radian Spice? You're running drugs now. How do you feel? I can guess, but I want to hear it. You asked me this before. I told you that my opinion is probably not one you want if you want to keep doing this. I will say it's not as bad as Serenity, though. So, you could be doing a lot worse, that's for sure. Ha. Huh. Uh, oh. Um, hey. Hello. I guess you two are busy then. Hmm. Yes. Oh my. Pardon. Did you. <sighs> did you need us for something? I'm heading to Cassetto for a business deal if you're interested in some kindred bonding. But. Oh. From the looks on your faces. Actually, yeah. I we can drop off these hides and then we'll catch up. Can you take this letter and give it to the captain there? Are you catching up, or...? Oh, Mr. Shriek! We're apparently on a... By the way... After, or? You can. I can't promise that I can wait on you, though. I just figured I should let you all know now. Um, Lorelai's playing a horrible, sick prank on people. Uh, she actually survived. She woke up this morning. Um... She wanted to come in and, um... Survived what? Yeah, Wait, did they go and actually fight the troll? 
she did mm -hmm. and um i could have sworn she wasn't um could have sworn she was pale I as a ghost i wish i had time to give my condolences but i honestly warned them several times so i i don't know she's not they're, they're not dead they're just Great. trying to trick everyone hopefully she's learned a life everyone. lesson then clearly um, not i'll see you there or i'll see you here when we're back you... yeah go ahead keep going we'll catch up if we catch up if not uh, we'll see you around are we still putting on the sad faces? <laughs> yeah. I can tell. Oh, that was so morbid. <clears throat> Very unlikely for the An surface. Elf, yeah. yeah. I wasn't sure if I should laugh or not. <clears throat> Everyone was quite sad yesterday when the news came. Ah. I was out of town. Yeah. Sif got banged up pretty bad, too. Oh, shit. I hope she's okay to continue her training. She's a day away from becoming more efficient with her throwing axe. Hmm. Making quick work. I know what... Well, when I first started doing this, I had no idea what it was, but I will not lie and say that I haven't experienced it myself. Um, are you comfortable with disclosing how Serenity made you feel when you took it? <clears throat> if you want to know. Yes, but not if it's going to put you in a bad space. Well, I do need to do this for space. a while. It is the only... <sighs> You're right. You fucking ass. Taking the serenity wasn't the problem. It numbed everything. It made everything feel so much better. It was... It was like every problem, every issue that you had wasn't there. You're just floating along. Open ocean, quiet lake. And what about spice? It's similar, but not as addictive as far as I'm know. The issue with serenity is that once you stop, that's... That's the problem. That's why people make so much money off it. They can get people hooked on it, then they have to come back for it. They'll sell everything and betray anyone to get more of it. I don't know if that's the case with Spice. I suppose it depends on the person. Right. I wanted to ask before, but I was nervous you'd... You know. Be pretty upset about it. When I found out what it was, I thought it was like cooking seasonings, but it is, but also not. Yeah, Apparently there's. It can be refined into that. Gradient spice and there's gradient spice. Hmm. Actually, Frenchie. Let's pick up the pace. What would, uh, oh. having Kyle as, uh, history with the drugs of Gradia and stuff like that. What would he know about Gradian Spice? So I can answer a bit more. But Gradian Spice. Gradian Spice. Well, Gradian mm. Spice. Uh, Gradian Spice. On its own, it is not uh, not highly addictive on its own. In an unrefined form. It's uh, Speaking of its refined form, you are fairly familiar with that being Serenity. So the processes by which it becomes that, you're hopelessly unaware. It's used um, in quite a lot of products in Gradia, from spiced wines and rums to being able to be baked into bread, for all sorts of things. It uh, has its uses. The issue is when it gets more refined, it becomes serenity. 
I don't know hmm. what it takes to do that, though. Neither do I. These are... This is good. It's preparing questions I have for the business partner I plan to make. You uh, also know, uh, Kyla, that uh, Guardian Spice, uh, true to its name, uh, has been molded uh, through uh, agriculture over the years to only grow in Guardian. It is a prized, very protected product, so much so that unauthorized growing of it even uh, can be met with severe punishment. It's quite a bit of heat that you're dealing with, though. I'm sure you already know the consequences of being found with this stuff, especially growing it. Well, I mean, I buy it from the merchants. Personal note, I'm not uh, growing it. purchasing Gradian spice on its own is not illegal, and just a nice thing to have. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> well, as long as you're not growing it, I suppose. Not doing anything right. illegal. Who would I speak to if I wanted to do that? <sighs> if you know. I have no idea. That's... You'd have to go through a lot of shady alleyways and a lot of unsavory people. Because even yeah, if it is... Farmer gave me a weird look when I asked him. Yeah, even if you could... I suppose you need some sort of license to have it regulated for you to do it legally. But even if you did do that, there'd be other people who are trying to capitalize it illegally that would want to push you out. It's a messy oh, process. I have so many ideas on how to capitalize on this land. It's lush and filled with things to take and give. But... The only woman I've seen in power, well, there's two of them that I've seen, is this captain, to some degree, and the Baroness. Unless she's some princess type like they have in Ireland, where they prance around in dresses and act like they are all the shit, but in reality, they can't even decide what they're eating for dinner. That's usually nobility, yes. <clears throat> Unfortunately, it's this... Land is a bit of a powder keg right now. <laughs> Though that could mean opportunities if you were resourceful enough, which. Mm. Oh. Without being an ass about it, Tyler, I could be generating 20 silver every three days. But, but, I need to establish myself better instead of just pandering shit on the street. <clears throat> it's a hierarchy. You gotta work your way up. Oh, I plan to, and I have other motives besides just making silver. Be careful which toes you step on on the way up. It's a very, uh, close-knit kind of environment. But it can change. Mm-hmm. It can adapt to me. It will. I plan to... <laughs> I have a lot of things planned. One of them involves you, really, but only if you want to get involved. I won't force it upon you, but the people that have harmed you in your life are not safe from me. Not here, not anywhere in Gradia. Should I be concerned? No. Not if I don't mi or not if I miss. You well, if I do miss, you should be concerned. If I don't, your life could be easier. You don't miss often. Duh. You mean to tell me you've gotten That's sloppy? That's when I say that, I then miss. No. Well. When we were together, I was in active combat every couple of days, so. 
Hmm. Now that that's changed, minus the merc work, I... Mm -hmm. I don't quite as often. The anxiety is ever-present, but... It's only because we're sandwiched in between two of our best friends. You know she owns that boat. Who? The captain. Ah, that usually is what being a captain denotes. Forgive my surprise, but it's been very rare that I see a woman in control of anything up here. Hmm. I'm enamored, really. I want to know what they did with their pointed ears to get there. This land is of opportunities, is it not? They would have stepped on a few toes. Whose toes? Uh, depends. Should I be avoiding? <clears throat> I don't know the climate. Like you said, it's very dynamic. I will say that, um, if you've heard anything about Blackrock Landing, I'd, uh, well, <laughs> it's basically ran by criminals. So if you wanted to work your way up in that area, that would be the place to mm -hmm. do it. But it's a very, uh, Certain people have <laughs> pressure over certain areas. It's very locked down. To make your way up, you have to start at the bottom there. You can't just decapitate at the head. Is the robber baron a criminal? Uh, by the sense of the word, I would suppose so. More of a rebel than anything from what I've heard, but... Hmm. I'm interested in that. Ooh. Sorry, my thumb is getting tired. Oh, there's a cart. I wonder who's here. Or who's leaving. I want to speak... speak... <laughs> speak. I want to speak with you more about it. And learn more about this spice. Because if it ends up being something that will... Harm not us. I'll be forced to drop it. So I will benefit from it while I can. At the very least. Mm, that's why I was... Saying if you wanted to keep doing this, you wouldn't want my opinion. <laughs> but I respect it enough that I think... Knowing... It'll give me the motivation to find other means. I see. Because if you go, I don't care. Fuck it, do what you want. I'm going to. But if you say, Sarah, this is going to change how I see you forever and I'm never going to speak to you ever again, you stupid bitch, then, you know, I might have to reconsider my business plans. I didn't think I had that much sway over you. How many times do I have to tell you? Get down there! Get me my drinks! Say again? Sorry. Got completely drowned out. I didn't realize I had that much sway over you. It's not sway. It's common sense. I think s someone I adore called it respecting someone even if you don't like it hey, I at least works. want to talk to her to see you know of course I've never been here before lead the way I think we have to go up here the uh, the entry to this building is not up there it is down there uh, this way I know what I'm doing. I'm a professional. Ah, oh, yes, it's the tavern. Mm. Hey. Hey. As you approach the I door, can. you do hear the captain's voice on the roof. Mm, thank you, family. It's almost as if you've been waiting for almost an hour. Mm. 
time for now. You'll be better next time, you understand? Happy? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Okay, understand. Ah, bonjour, welcome. It's good to see you again. Nice to see you. Hmm. Okay. If you'd like to have a seat, uh, are you free for a conversation? Conversation? We don't have anything scheduled to let her no? We should be good. Mm. Uh, we should be good, yes. Good night, this seat would be wonderful. I just finally got my morning drink after I've been waiting for almost an hour. You're usually so good about that. Uh, somewhere private, maybe. Right. And you just start out here with my pool in the bar. We'll go inside, it's a lot more comfortable. I can head back. Hey, yes. I'll make sure <laughs> things cleared out for right now. Uh, thank you, make sure. You don't want too many people down there, eh? For having a quiet conversation. Nice. Ah. Always give me the piss water in the morning. Never the good stuff. Piss please, please, water. come in, come in. So, a private conversation with me. What is the, uh, the occasion? I mean... Hmm. Captain, do you wish for me in Silver 2? Ah, no, you are fine on your own. It should be fine, unless of course this needs to be a private, private conversation. I mean, I have... Someone in here, it's only fair that you do as well. I think Shiva, you go downstairs and I call upon you if you be. That way we have one on one, not so many. I trust mm -hmm. you with my life. Would sure you do the same with yours? Absolutely. <laughs> I'm glad we're in agreement. So, what can I do for you? I was wondering if you are hurting for any business deals in Notus. Hmm. Hurting for any business deals? What the... What are you offering? And maybe I can tell you yes or no? What are your opinions on Gradient Spice? It's a fine product, it sells well, right? May I be a bit intrusive on your business? So oh, intrusive. I want to know mm. how much you sell and buy Gradient Spice for. Forgive me if that's improper. I'm afraid I cannot uh, disclose that information. What if I said for every one unit of Gradient Spice I can give you two silver? Does that exceed your amount or not? That would be uh, overcharging, that would be unfair to you. No, it would not. Trust me. It would be good for both of us, actually. Are you a merchant? Is this why you were bringing this up for me? I know I hired you as, uh... As mercenary help. That is something I do know. I am a... I'm a person in need of coin for just a bit until I can afford certain things. Whether you want to continue business with me afterwards is up to you, or I could waddle back over to my Well, if you're uh, eager for coin, I have mercenary work, but... 
It sounds like you want something else instead. Why not both? Why ask about the spice? I have a connection that is very reliable. For coin. And I need hmm. a connection that's very reliable for spice. Someone who I can rely on to have it when I ask. Hmm. <laughs> you know, instead of uh, Koi for doing this mercenary work for me, I could pay you in spice instead. <laughs> I'm sure you would be a beneficiary. No, oh, you want the spice, you, you earn it that way. Fine. Might I ask how many units are you comfortable with disclosing for something like that? That did uh, depend on the level of work. I have a, a caravan waiting to be escorted. Xavier, come here. It could be about two, three, spice, uh, depending. Ah, proofread. I have your jobs mm -hmm. a bit more, obviously, but, uh, if that sounds like something you're willing to do, we can definitely negotiate that instead in your contract. I think it's a great start. Mm. We'll get there. Ah, oh, wonderful. Then if that's the case, then we have it in writing. And would that be three spice in total, or three spice each? Oh, I see. Hmm. I'd have to get to know him first. That is what we are doing. Because I certainly do not, uh, not know this fellow. You Maybe I know. not this time. Not this time for him. Mm. Well, <clears throat> if we are wishing to do something like this, then by all means, we can sign the contract now, have that written. Know who we are. Oh, this is awkward. You look like people with a lot of coin and goods. Why? I like to give you a brief explanation. Sarah took a protection job. You were sitting in the back of the cart and it stopped. You hear some chatter on the other side. The meeting went well as far as you're aware. You stepped outside for a bit and then they left. And you arrived to this. Such as yours. Now, are you going to be causing problems? Or are we going to get a little more physical in our negotiation? Maybe we can maybe twist your arm a little bit with these regards. Negotiation is not yet off the table. Because I really want you to take a good Admit who you are attacking. <laughs> Wait, is that? Wait, so that means you're. Oh boy. Um. You know what? I'm. Um, well. You know, Some actually, items are... you know what, lads, maybe give we can go on to the count of ten to make your decision before I make it for you.
Better yet, what? I don't need to. Here, now get off my face. We will not rest your crew. Um. A small pile of silver, about five by your count, falls into the man's hand. All right, lads. Let's get back. Oh. No business left to be doing here. Come on. Get moving. You shoot one of them. Take your pick. She's gonna shoot Come the on. one in white. <laughs> With a three, it goes wide past his head. That day, sorry. You know, <laughs> Shariq, you jinxed it. That's kind of why I wanted a sword, I'll be honest. <laughs> Luckily, sorry, you we too. have this uh, fine gentleman with us. Who knows what he's doing? The bandits around here should know by now not to meddle too much. We've been coming back and forth now to where I believe they should be acquainted. Sorry about your silver. I can try to pay you back. No, me. In due time. Right. right, well. If anything, let's go up that later. Before they come back. Oh. Cool. Uh, yeah, you okay. didn't fuck it up. <laughs> you were fine. No. As I said, the bandit should really know better. What? Well, went okay. That's pretty scary, huh? A little. <laughs> I didn't think I needed to get out of the cart, but. Did you see the one weapon? Oh. That one looked like a, a pole arm, but it had a um, like a knife on the end of it. Not a sphere, but it was like curved a little you bit. You both ready? Hmm. Live, damn you, live. I'm going to make it someone's fucking problem. <laughs> I'm go going to from behind the next person I fucking see. You may be better off teleporting to uh, Sarah if you can. <laughs> They're right there. <laughs> oh, they are right there. I thought they were running faster. Why do, why do these things happen to me, Frenchie? with anyone named the Robber Baron. Sorry, that's not a good question. 
I know of him. I know he's around these parts. But I know nothing of the man. I won't try then. Freedom fighter. Did you hear that? A freedom fighter. Is that what he called himself? Oh, you're speaking to the bandit? He called himself a liberator of uh, Liberator. Groups. What does that mean? Uh, I guess it's the idea of taking what belongs to someone else under the belief that they have been taken wrongly? Bandits have been using all sorts of words they've picked up in ways to negotiate or intimidate. And as you see, I do am not you... so very much easily swayed. Mm. Do you possibly know who they work for, if anyone? Those ones? Usually... Uh, no, I'd say they're more of small fish. More of a, you see, roving group that has probably earned some sort of notion and now they feel bold enough to try and attack seeing as they didn't know who we were hmm. looks like bears appear out of everywhere so you think at least maybe it's been common knowledge now to avoid us Right. That one cracks me up, Silver. Liberators. <laughs> what do you think he heard that one? I don't know. He said it with a lot of um, confidence. <laughs> Absolutely. He was almost certain that his. Uh, his stance was the right one, and he was going to truly claim our goods. Ah, foolish, foolish man. I had a bolt for each of them. Well, now I don't. Oh, I should have gotten mine. Fuck. It's alright, I'll just get more. Sorry for, um, kind of throwing you under the bus in there. Got a bit greedy. It happens. Besides, we got to see some bandits shit themselves. Yeah. If you want, from the uh, spice, I'll make quite a bit of silver. As an apology, I could give you a little extra. Only if you don't need it. I want to actually talk to you about that. It's a crazy theory, but you seem to be a voice of reason, so. I'll counsel as best as I can. Ah, motives. <laughs> Always better from an outside view. You know the truth. No, plans for the day. no, I'm not allowed to work in the forge, so. Have you eaten? I haven't had an appetite. Well, maybe we can get some oranges and then we could talk to that fisherman and see if he's nice enough to provide us some crab. If not, We'll find something else. Or we can go catch our own. I see what you're doing. I'm not opposed to it. I'm not doing anything. You want me to be truthful. 
I, I didn't even know I was going to come and see you anyway, but someone caught me before I got to you. And I just worry for you. I don't want you to sit around by yourself. Or, I don't know. No, it's over. Ease her into town. Make sure no runny buddy hold her. I appreciate just that. Just let me know if it's too much, alright? I could be convinced to nibble an orange, maybe. I, uh... hmm. Hello. Oh, coming through. What a beautiful woman to grace my present. And here I was picking flowers. <laughs> I'm a man, fuck you. I'll to get you some. I like the purple one. I'll speak to you later. There's a reason she's our finest horse. Right. Ah, good day. Easy, Bobby. Um, good day, Sarik. Good to see you. Do you need assistance? No, it's okay. Just making sure these people get to where they need to go. All right. Ah, uh, <laughs> how's it going? Uh, well, excuse me, morning. I don't even know just um, yeah, be careful, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I love Silver, if there you could whiskey, Marcus. take one of these crates and bring it to Biscuit for Marco. Mr. Marco. Biscuit, well, I Biscuit, I pay our friend here. Is it gonna be the first bit of work we're gonna be doing? Towards these walls? Boss already gave me. Ouch. Three units of your choice. Thank you. I need to go into further, of course. I appreciate your assistance, and I apologize for you having to deal with uh, clueless ruffians on the, on the streets. Yeah. I've dealt with it way more than I should have. It's fine. I <laughs> hope to see you and your boss soon. And you as well, Silver. It was a lovely ride. Thank you for the information. Of course. Yeah. You basically have to have a, a great rest of your day. And the captain will graciously await your next arrival. Thank you. Of course. You want to get changed before you eat? <coughs> sure. You weren't joking about these stones. Mm -hmm. Nope. Did, uh, did a court break uh, happen uh, is, to open up? Nine units of it. <gasps> Jesus. A lot of stone. Kind of fix it if it doesn't look right. Yeah, it looks good to me. <laughs> um, I have slippage. I'll uh, wait down here. Yeah.
food, 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 food. Hmm. After you. Making notches in wood. <laughs> oh, I see. Thank you. <laughs> if it's very similar, you might <laughs> just anything that a large blade would be too cumbersome for. Good. That's what I intend to do with it. But that should help. Yeah, yeah I just, just need the wood. Oh. And considering it's just, it's tech fair. <coughs> Speaking of, how much is wood going for at the moment? Oh, it's been fluctuating. Visit your bow or whoever it is. <laughs> yes, miss. Two of your finest oranges, please. And two really nice dinners, if you can. Very well. And I'll hold that would be uh, 50 copper. Do you take Gradian Spice? <clears throat> Thank you, miss. Mm -hmm. Please uh, find a seat. I will bring your items out to you. Thank you. There's Sanders over there. What, the Imperial? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> I heard the strangest rumor. About... the Imperial? Mm-hmm. Two of my finest. Thank you. Is it that he uh, hallucinates? <laughs> He's infatuated with you, apparently. Aren't like most human men, though. I suppose. Oh. Hey, How Sif. are you feeling, Sif? Ouch. Like shit. Is that your dominant arm? Thankfully, no. I can get you a bind if you uh, need it. That'll be fine, it's just sore. Well, once we have our food, we can do some practice. Though I will need to check the um, mercenary building first to see. That's fine. I'm waiting for L to come back so I can go scout something. Alright, then maybe the evening. Sure, that'll work for me then. Mm. You're going to eat? Who told you this rumor, by the way? I'm curious. You know I hear things, just by being a ramp. Overhearing people as I share at the turn. tavern. I didn't think he was. Thank you. But, I am very used to that, especially here. Apparently they're less disgusted with it and more enamored. Brody is a mixing pot of all races. Mm. 
What did you want to talk about? Um, nothing really, just... I thought that was something you wanted to ask me. Was there? Fuck. <laughs> you can ask when it comes like to it. I forgot know. the password. I guess I'm just worried about you, that's all. Nothing I'm not used to by this point, I guess. Just... Yeah, but... Doesn't mean that's okay. I just hope you know that... No matter what time it is, you can come find me. Not in a... Like a creepy way or anything, but, you know. We could just, like, sit in silence and... I don't know. I used to do that with someone when I was feeling a little too down to be by myself. And they were really good at being quiet. Something, a uh, skill I picked up from them actually, <laughs> believe it or not. Thank you. I do appreciate it. I, I don't mean to seem unappreciative. I'm just uh, kind of numb right now, I guess. In these times, it's hard to um, hear our friends and our loved ones because those negative feelings are too strong. I do not find you unappreciative. I just know that some people really want reassurance. Whether it's in large amounts or small amounts. I know I do. is so fucking annoying but it's too hot <sighs> those bags under your eyes <laughs> we need to do something about them I'm gonna ask the bathhouse workers to fix the bags under my eyes. Yeah, they, uh, they... They have this shit called makeup. I'm not looking for that specifically, but I'm sure they know a thing or two of how to... help with... that. Hey, if they think they can patch this up, more power to them. It's been a little late nights, I guess. Well, I want to do it. But they can teach me. I won't stop you. I know you probably don't want to be seen right now. You better be careful with those words. Because if you do end up stopping me, I'm going to be sad. I'm going to call you a liar. <sighs> as long as it isn't humiliating. No. But I might have to... I don't know. Rub, like, cold fruit on your eyes or something. Cold fruit. What? I don't know. Yeah, it's got good things in it that make your skin better. I wouldn't know. For the longest time, I just I rubbed know. dirt in my hair. <sighs> That's disgusting no, and it, counterproductive. No, it gets dirty so you can style it. If it's all nice and clean and poofy, it just kind of flops. Put dirt in it, it gets gritty, you can shape it. That's how we used to do it back in Corcadas. When we cared enough to do it. Some people used fat. Animal fat. 
In the Underdark, your hair would have been braided back. The longer the hair, the more desirable the <clears throat> man was. Oh. Quite the opposite for women, we wear our hair up. Or short. I just let my hair go where it wants, I guess. <clears throat> Seems to have worked out for me so far. I think your hair's fine, yes. Was it like something How does Torty get those things? <laughs> what, the uh, adornment in her hair? No, her hair is like in like little sections, and it's like a long... You know. Do you want one? No, I just wondered how they work. You want to go ask her? I think she's in her shop right now. If you'd finished eating. If you did eat. So you take a few bites, but... He's... You do need to eat. like half the orange and just kind of push the food around on his plate. I'm eating. Well, I hope we can all the excitement tonight. You remind me how much that meal costs. My stomach just feels really... I don't know. <laughs> I've never had it before. And easy, I guess. I'm trying, I am. I... It's alright. Yeah. Yes, eat your orange at least. I'd be very worried if you didn't finish it. <clears throat> God, I've been having the, worst luck. the spirit is willing, but... Is that so? Oh, a few of it's too much, I can just get a spin. Yeah. You don't need to be sorry. I don't mean to be a drag, yeah. Sarah. White shirt, dark pants, Why are you beating yourself up yeah, so much? I could literally sit and stare at you for hours, and I mean that in full creepy. Perhaps you might, might, you know, Ask we could him. probably see if we have something for you. You don't even have to say anything. That'd be nice. I just want you to know that I'm here. That's it. I, can I don't need I anything else. Stock, but in all honesty, it might be a I'm still very, uh... <laughs> it, it's surreal. I feel like I'm gonna wake up one day. Find back to the dirt. Is what I mean to say. Next. And this all would have been a dream. I don't want to waste medical supplies. So I'm going to cherish it while it's around, just in case, you know. My mind has been capable of far greater hallucinations. All you have to do is get Neil Ulrich to approve it. Yes, you're fine. I saw him earlier, but far be it for me to stop you. If you're not concerned, we'll just sign off on the papers. You can have it. Your father is worried, though. Sleep if at all, we can just when isn't he? Sleepy time potion. Okay. You're right. Well, whenever you're ready. One bottle of What's he worried about? Even if you feel like you can. Now that's a prescription well, you. Yeah, but what about me? Yeah. I got you know, sick the one day. I won't, uh, had to, had to drink hmm? this, uh, I know that you know that he's aware of what you've been through. Oh, you can't follow me around. And the relationship that you have with him. His pain is your pain, and your pain is his. Good. <laughs> Good medicine. That's all. Sarah, I hope I'm not bothering you. Works, it works. You know... Hello. I just, wanted to, I just wanted to let you know that I do have more grinding spice. Oh, nice drinks. Were the prices any better than last time? Yes, I'm working the, uh, the price is still going to be about the same, but I have four units left. Soma being Soma, of course, hardly drank any of it. It's not like the first time you've seen me behind a tavern before. But elected to take it back to his office. No, I know. So that he can use it to sterilize. I can get you five silver for four units. 
Thank you, mysterious woman in red. So you've been hearing mm. shit about the fucking Imperial, but not the fortune teller's daughter. Oh, I knew about that. That wasn't a rumor. Mm. <laughs> a few nights ago, I had a... Help me! I don't know how to navigate that. I've never... It's a woman. Anyway, oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, I can get you five silver for the four units, if you have them. I, I do have them. I do have them now. Awesome. Um, I do not have the five silver just yet, but I will tonight. Mm -hmm. Can I give yeah. you one silver right now and then four silver later? Yeah, that's fine. I think if it does collateral, that's a new word I've learned. Here is the silver. Thank you. And this is four units. I'll uh, leave it with your husband if I can't find you, and if not them, then the tavern key. Of course. Thank you. Good day. Collateral. And if it makes you feel any better. Well, yes. Uh, my. I don't have that. enough. Give them all the sword like a dagger. I do not keep things. Like don't look at me like that. I'm trying to figure no, this shit out by myself with no fucking like help from either of the like Morgals or any of the other no. merchants. I don't fucking know what I'm doing. No, I don't like no, having like some like just that. on standby. I like to get rid of it as soon as I have it. And I like having the silver. And I use it to benefit the people that I care about. Yeah, you, and Cassidy, and their daughter. Um, I mean, <clears throat> Tazim. There's a tiny just bit of guilt in my chest. Impressed, that's all. Impressed? I'm floundering like a fish. Not with what you're saying now, with what you're doing, what you're learning. Why we hold swords, How you're navigating the deals and, and all of the Imperium, if what you figure it out all today, and it's national treasure. <laughs> well, the things that they don't like on the surface is how things work where I'm from. They're, at least what I know, a coin is not as valuable in the Underdark. Trade is information, secrets. Backstab, blackmail, whatever you want to call it. Power is what people want most, not coin. Status. I'm still learning the way of coin and I'm saving up for something. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. But I can't talk about that here. Unless he wants a dagger, no. Because, you know, you stab into armor. But not worry. Nope, you've done it. I've taken the coin and it's been added to the purse. Thank you, though. I appreciate it. Mm. Makes me feel like I'm not so stupid. No, you're figuring it out. You want to know something crazy? With what I've just done, and with no coin out of my pocket, I will make 14 silver today. I was doing the maths on what you just bought. Mr. Shield, we find any works. I haven't found shit. Yes, that's who me. Just in general, I'm a blacksmith. I don't know. Are you going to take my advice and then do the exact fucking opposite again? What do you mean? Arguing at the bar. Or this, Aye. or this, well, or this, when you have it like that, you can only do it like this. Like that was rude. Motion, but but you only you go, You're an idiot. It's so much better. Well, listen, yeah. this Why? Oh, this brings me no, back. I don't wear armor to the surgeons. You said don't dilly dally, and I didn't dilly dally. I see myself being slowed or being slowed down by this. No, I don't have any work for you. Did you check the Merc building? I did, several times. It's not even there. No one's in there. 
Good. Guess we're fucked on that. We're gone today. <coughs> Wasn't it quiet yesterday as well? I don't know. Strange. It was very quiet. Not trying to be greedy. I've already done my work for the day. Sorry, though. Maybe no. tomorrow. Well, I hope we're better luck tomorrow. She wasn't breathing anymore. She's great. It's quite good. That's the understanding I have. How did... what? Am I doing enjoying it? Are you just eating bread? Do you want to go talk, though? It's a, I mean, it's a. How are you feeling, Miss Laura? Eh? All I know is the most grievous uh, injury talk? that I got. Yeah. Where the You're going to be so backed up. Oh, that, that. Uh, no, this isn't just bread. It's it's a bread bowl. It's got stew on the inside. Oh. Ooh. No amount of damage. It's really good, no, actually. It's the, uh, the the bread it does a nice job. Like the interior, uh, the, the crust is hard enough that it functions like a bowl, while the interior soaks up some of the steam. It's really nice. We truly live in wondrous times. <laughs>